Hi, good morning. My name is Dr. Eric Phipps. Um, I have one of my patients here, Mary, with me, and um, she's been suffering from chronic shoulder problems. So one of the questions I get with a lot of patients is, what else can you do for my shoulder problem? One of the therapies that I personally like to use, and it's very commonly used with professional athletes, is kinesio tape or kinesiology tape. But the basic function, function of the tape here is that you can order it in pre-wrap cuts like this or you can actually cut your own pieces. Um, I personally like to make my own cuts, but for this example we're just going to use a pre-cut kinesio tape. So one of the conditions is, one, like I said, a shoulder condition where there's a lot of pain. And um, what has happened by, with the body is usually the shoulder drops out of place, out of socket. So the objective, what I'm trying to do with the patient, is to naturally bring the shoulder back up into the socket so the muscles can relax and the patient can, can stop experiencing the pinched nerve pain that is usually accompanied with the shoulder pain. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a standard piece of kinesiology tape. The tape is pre-cut, so I can tear this right down the middle. And what I'm going to do with this tape is I'm going to build a harness here for the shoulder to help to pull the shoulder back up into the, into the socket. And that will help to relieve the muscle tension once again. So with this tape, just a little background on the tape, the tape is 100% cotton. The glue on the tape is an acrylic glue. So if I were to peel this back and you, had, you took a look at the way the glue was formed on here, you would see that it resembles the skin of your finger. It's much like the, the waves of the skin on your finger. So the tape is actually the exact same dimension um, width as your skin. So the concept is to put this th the uh, therapeutic modality on a patient that is going to help the patient, but the patient's really not going to know that there is something there. And they can continue going on with their daily life and have the necessary support there. So once again, I showed you how the tape is elastic. You can see that by the stretching motion here. So what I want to do to help pull this shoulder up into the position is I'm going to, as I put the tape on, I'm going to move her shoulder in certain positions to where I can achieve um, more tension and help to pull the shoulder back up into the socket. The first interest or first objective I need to do is locate where the deltoid muscle comes down and inserts onto the humerus. I'm then going to connect the kinesio tape right at the base of the insertion. Apply the tape, work the best I can not to touch the tape. Once I put it on the skin, the, skin, the tape is heat activated. So the friction by my hands here help to activate the tape and help the glue to stick. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to make two cuts just by pulling the tape here and we're going to set our anchor down. So we have the, the first part of the ankle done with a quarter inch cut and then I'm not going to use any tension right here and just basically place the tape up on the skin. So we want to activate the glue with a couple strokes like that and then we look here here's the insertion of the deltoid muscle so first what we want to do is support the posterior aspect of the shoulder so I'm going to have the patient bring their arm up and just rest it on their other shoulder this skin now in the posterior portion of the shoulder is stretched so what I'm going to do with the tape so I'm going to roll her shirt up right here so we can actually put this tape back here but I'm going to peel the the, the um, paper off of the tape. You can see the tape there. And then I'm going to take the tape to about a 50 to 70% stretch. So this is no tension. There's 50, there's 70, there's 100% stretch. I don't want 100% stretch. I want about 50% stretch since we've already got a nice tension on the skin here with the movement that she did. So I'm going to follow the shoulder up come up to the insertion where the supraspinatus is and then we're going to attach the end of the tape or the tail of the tape with no tension once again. So all the tension now is between here and there helping to support this elbow and now pulling the shoulder back into the socket. So we've addressed the posterior portion of the deltoid right now. So now I'm going to have the patient come down, relax the arm down and we're going to work with the anterior portion of the elbow of the shoulder. So the way to achieve tension by that is by having the patient move their arm to the back. 
and try to roll their shoulder back like this. So now there's a lot of tension on the skin right here. So my objective here is to stretch the tape and have it come up over the, the um, coracoid process where we have the insertion of, of the pectoralis and other muscles there. And um, we're gonna run that right up to that insertion there. So I take the tape, no tension, 50%, 70, 100. So we're going about 50% tension going up the front, following the shoulder blade, and at the end, once again with the tail, there's no tension there. So, I'm gonna use my finger to provide friction here. It's a warming action to activate the glue for the tape. As soon as this glue is activated, you always ask your patients not to perform any kind of exercises for 30 minutes after applying the tape, so the glue can stick as well as possible. You just ask the person to relax their arm. So now when she relaxes her arm down, there is the tension that we put on the tape, helping to pull this back up to the socket, allowing the muscles to start to relax, the tendonitis to start to disperse, and the inflammation as well. And I always ask my patient afterwards, does that feel all right there? Yeah, I can't feel anything other than, I mean, I, I feel it, but I don't feel like it's, you know, bothering me from you putting my shoulder back. It's, I can put my shirt down it's like it's not even there great and that's and that's the main concept behind the tape is to put something therapeutic on a patient that they can actually wear this for the next three to five days they can shower with the tape you can go swimming with the tape um, you can do about every one of your normal daily activities and most people within ten, the next 10 minutes don't even notice that the tapes there mm -hmm. but it is actually working and that's how you you would do a basic shoulder taping for with kinesio tape for a shoulder Thank you very much.